Hello and welcome to another video of the um, CTrader Algo Strategy Building Tool. Um, today I'm going to explain briefly how to set up your trade rules. I've already defined three indicators that we're going to use. This is simple moving average 14 period, simple moving average 50 period, and the relative and st strength index indicator, which is 14 periods, and upper and lower threshold, which is 70 and 30, which is defined here. We're all on a one hour time frame. You can set different time frames if you wish. I'm going to go to the trade rules and I'm going to set up a simple basic strategy based on these indicators using the trade rules. So to get started, I'm going to click on the red text here that says click here to add a new trade rule. And I'm going to select the SMA 14. In the trade rules, um, there are two trade rules. It's a bullish signal or crossed above. And the trade rules for bearish uh, trade rules are a bearish signal and crossed below. So for this one, I'm going to do crossed above because the SMA 14 has crossed above the SMA 50. So this would be a crossover of two MA indicators. So it's indicator one and indicator two. For most indicators, you'll only have indicator one. You won't need indicator two because we're just going to define a bullish or bearish trade signal. I'm going to save this. I'm going to go ahead now and select also the RSI indicator has to be bullish. If you attempt to select crossed above or select a indicator here, it will just save it as a bullish signal. You do not require indicator two or an RSI for this type of indicator because here it's just going to give a bullish signal when the um, RSI line goes below the level 13 and a bearish signal when the RSI level goes above 70. This is defined in the user guide. You should be able to find it there. So to very two very basic trade rules we're going to set up, which is SMA 14 has crossed above SMA 50 and the RSI indicator is bullish. Again, we can do the same for a bearish trade rule. Now, they, don't be the, they do not need to be the same. You can have different trade rules for a bullish trade and different rules for a bearish to either send trade signals or open up a trade. So here I'm just going to do the reverse. I'm going to do the SMA 14 as cross below SMA 50. I'm going to save this. And I'm going to say the RSI indicator is bearish. OK, so it's a complete reverse. So this is your trade rules now we've set up. Um, it's very basic. Um, it'll open up a buy trade or send a trade signal when the SMA crosses above 50 and there's an RSI as bearish or bullish or bearish. So that's it. That's the uh, very basic overview of the trade rules. Um, so if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up. Thanks very much.